Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today we'll be playing through some more Final Fantasy VII Remake, of course. What else would we be playing right now? Take a second before we begin to hit the like button as I give a humongous shout out to all of the new patrons. Holy moly, I get a notification in my email inbox that we have a new patron probably three times a day. I cannot believe it. I am so thankful for all of your support. It really means the world to me and it allows me to continue upgrading the setup, to devote more time to streaming and posting videos, and to hopefully build out Team Strange Rebel so that we can... Uh, do even more awesome stuff in the future of this channel. I'm very, very excited about it and I appreciate all of your part in it so, so much. And now, let's get on to that gameplay video. Enjoy! To Madam M's! No soldiers are showing up. Oh, look, look at this! They're throwing confetti for me, the victor who defeated Hell House in one try. I was incredible, thank you. Oh, that person loves Aerith. I do too. What are you looking at? Oh, the workout room? Is there any... Last time I came in here, there wasn't really anything interesting or exciting about it. It was just like a bunch of people working out. Is it only dudes in here? Where's the ladies working out? Get out of town! Where's where's the girl gym? I don't know about that. Who are you? Congratulations on winning the tournament. Oh, that's Johnny's You're an father. Impressive fighter. Thank you. I know that you'll be a great influence on my Johnny. Why you might even end up having a friendly rivalry. Mm. You can spur each other to greater heights. I don't heights. know about that. I can see it. You two will become great friends. The ah! best of friends. I don't know if I... <laughs> mm, I didn't sign up for that, Johnny's father. I, I didn't ask for that. Chadley. Do you have anything fun for me? Talk about a match. I don't hope you will continue to help me day. gather vital information for my research. Nothing fun for me just yet, but don't worry, I'll be back. So... Straight to Madam M's then? Seems like. Although, I do feel some little tiny desire to go into every tiny alley at every given moment to see if finally I can take all of those treasure chests in the area. I feel compelled. Well, oh, I'm not going to be able to get to it from there. Excuse me, Aerith. Excuse me. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, man. What am I doing up here? Oh, there's a path. Okay. Oh, no, I'm stuck. I'm lost. Have I been in there? It's a shop. Oh yes, I was in here. And he's like, I just sell items. And I was like, suspicious, hey sir. Ah, uh, yes. We stock the opposite. Stuff. He says, we stock other stuff too. Anything interesting? We do need some high potions, but they are expensive here. So we'll just get the one. Okay. We'll just Thanks leave that much. as it is. And that's the thing that shot me, which means Madam M's is up here. Ooh, look, bank. This was the materia shop. Anything good in here? Oh yeah, and this guy was like laying down. See the sign out front? Ah, this is the guy. That was like, all we sell is materia. And I'm like, you definitely sell other things here, sir. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I would like to have a second fire materia. Just because then you have it. But it's 
kind of pricey and we might find one and we might wish we had the gill so thanks buddy thank don't thank me i didn't give you any money Oh, bed. Yeah, oh, I love bed. Okay, madam. What say you? You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very Is she about to send us on a mission? It's like they say, good things come to those mm. who What goes around? I already around. did your Coliseum battle, ma'am. might surprise you. <laughs> I'm going to put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw dropper. All right. Now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? Okay. Huh? Don't waste my time. If you have things to do, then get out there and do them. Well, listen, I didn't know until now, madam. Okay, madam. I'm ready. Like I said, once you change, you won't be able to leave oh, town. Oh, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready now? I'm ready now. All right, then. Let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Oh, I love her hairstyle. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> So I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. How to hey, have fun? No one asked you to do that. In Walmart? But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Eric, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch! Seriously? Well, Rude! I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. <laughs> well, you know what we have to do then. Sorry. We gotta, we gotta just see what happens if you try to peek. Obviously, she's not gonna let us. But I have to try and see if she actually pokes our eyes out. I thought I told you. No peeking. Oh! <laughs> did you see what Cloud did with his hand there? He was like reaching for it and then was like, Not me. I didn't try to reach for that curtain. Well, now we have to try again because it's going to let us try again. So don't be mad. You have a lot of nerve. Oh, you did it again! <laughs> One more time. How old are you? <laughs> okay, I just have to see how many dialogue options they did for this. I thought I told you. No peeking. You have a lot of nerve. Okay, so I think it's just the three. That's pretty funny. How old are you? <laughs> All right, that's fun. Okay. Uh, okay. Now, we've been told to have fun in Wall Market. Now that our, <laughs> as she described, our old ball and chain is busy, uh, now we can actually go out and have fun like a man deserves. Although, I don't know how much more fun he could have in Wall Market without Aerith holding him back when he already got a super saucy, luxurious hand massage where they talked about the tips and caressing the palms. I mean, come on. 
Aerith was there for that. I think it would be okay for Cloud to enjoy whatever he wanted in Wall Market with her around. Uh, okay. That said, where are we going? To Chocobo Sam? And he's gonna teach us how to enjoy Wall Market? What could Chocobo Sam possibly have to add to our adventures? Um. Hey, you think that guy's doing okay? Oh, yeah. He wasn't but this street. The one that everyone says is bad news. That's one of the alleys where there's treasure down there, but... Or there's... Is there treasure? Yeah, there's treasure, but then there's people blocking it. So maybe now that we've been told you won't be able to leave town, we can check it out. Let's see. I think it was this way. Yeah, these guys are still there. When do they leave? Aren't you a curious cat? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. Yeah, okay. Still can't go back there. And then this guy, it, they just, here's what's weird to me. Normally when a game draws attention to something, it's for a reason. So you would you have to ask yourself why the game is specifically drawing attention to going to back this alley. Maybe it's a reference to the original Final Fantasy VII? I don't really know. But... I don't know. <laughs> So we'll just ignore that then. And head on over to Chocobo Sam. Howdy. Madam M said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Uh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. But when it comes to damn near anything else, I can't help but have my doubts. Okay, rude. That, but then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons, neither. Seeking new experiences. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect her while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Why not? So Sam's in here <laughs> That's a spirit. with you have an offer for gigs. Tonight, Mr. Mark. And the gig is just to have fun. That's kind of fun. On the other hand, one thing that's so curious to me, and, and something that I almost have to comment on because of the nature of me being the voice of Aerith, the game consistently in this portion consistently seems to point out like Cloud and Aerith as a couple. It is non-stop in this chapter. And I have to wonder, is that to like please the people who, who ship Cloud and Aerith? And then I'm guessing because it's very much a Cloud is the hero and every girl is going to fawn over him because that's how the game is written. I'm guessing Tifa gets an equal amount of attention in the later chapters as well. So <laughs> I'm just real interested to see where it goes. Uh, <laughs> you have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Mark. Okay, is that all you're gonna say? You have yourself yeah, a grand okay. Time so we've been given some side quests here. The party never stops. And burning thighs. I have a feeling I know what burning thighs is a reference to. So I think we're just gonna head on over directly there. I saw the new if I don't get lost. <sighs> am I lost already? Sure am. Yep, here we go. And here we are. Never seen you before. <laughs> here to work out. Put some muscle on that bony frame of yours. Suddenly, there's some goofy characters in the gym. 
Wow, I've been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming, and welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Want to try taking on one of our guys? I've got a little time to spare. Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I could snap him like a twig. Rude! Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. I think we have to give it a go, don't you? I think we must. So, you up for a round? I'm up for a round, but... Okay, so here's our prizes. Three Mega Potions, an Orb of Luck Up Materia, and a Champion Belt. Okay. Uh, you're taking me on? You look like a dried up old Terpsicult left out in the sea. What is a Terpsicult? You got no idea what you're Oh, into, that swinging seahorse? All right. Okay. Let's talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squat off. Now, let's all see what you've got. A squat off. Just... No way I'm letting you win. Oh man, okay, so here we go. The basic rules. Perform more squats than your opponent in the allotted time to win. In the event of a tie, you will lose. Follow the on-screen guide. Press the corresponding buttons at the right moment to perform squats. As you proceed, the guide will gradually fade from view and you will have to watch Cloud's movements to determine when to press the appropriate buttons. I'm usually very bad at rhythm games. I'm usually really bad at them. So hopefully I can do a little bit better. Let's find out. Okay. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. You've got this, come on. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. That's how how long do I have to do this? You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. How long do I have to do this? That's how it's done. I knew you could do it. Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. You got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. How fast can I go? Do I determine how fast it is? You do it. You got this. Come on. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. You got this. Come on. That's how it's done. I knew you could. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. I knew you could. You got this. Come on. Okay. I mean, that's was never in doubt. What what is supposed to be hard about that? Oh my god! <laughs> what? Why did he get twelve? How how do you fall down? How do you mess up at this game? I don't I don't really get it, but okay. <laughs> How the hell did I lose to this scrawny little kid who looks like he doesn't even consume his daily recommended amount of protein? Scrawny, <laughs> you know it's all about quality, not mass. You're too quick to judge people by their build. Yeah, tell him, Jules. And your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger. Bold here. challenger here. <laughs> Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson. And sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud? We're all one big family here at this gym. And now you're Oh, that was that simple for me to be a part of the family? Training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. Okay. Oh, look how cute they are with their poses. Okay, amateur difficulty unlocked. Okay. So I am guessing that If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk to Jay or Ronnie. Okay, so let's see. We let let's see. You want to go, do ya? All right then, bring it on. Okay, so we already got three mega potions. Now, if we challenge him and win, we get an orb of luck up materia. Okay. So this is the next level. Let's see. Let's see what hap Are What we have to do this? here. 
Oh, okay, okay. All right, cool. I was trying to go faster than it. Okay. That's how it's done. Your forms look pretty thin, you guys. What is this? What the heck is that? You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come on. I knew you could do it. You two are doing awesome. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. Not bad at all. Okay. okay. I don't really know what this mini game with the X does. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. You've got this. Come on. Come on. I know you've got more to get. Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. That's how it's done. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. I can see how they're trying to mess me up. I can I almost like feel the burn myself. Oh wow. Okay. We had to beat 30 and we beat 30. Oh man, my heart's beating so fast. I like stopped breathing during that. Oh man, okay. So I can totally really see how me. it gets difficult and how shape. and how they try to mess you up. It's unfair that you guys are having all the fun. by making you press all what the X's. May I have this squat? Oh, he's asking me for a dance. Oh, nice. Okay. So it's interesting. As long as you don't go too fast, you can pretty much dictate your own pace once the symbols on the screen disappear. You can't dictate the pace when the symbols are appearing. So I think that's the way that they get you to mess up is because you don't just have to keep rhythm, you have to keep rhythm with the changes that they determine at you, which is interesting. <laughs> you up for some exercise? <sighs> Deep breaths. It's gonna be a 60 second challenge. I think. Oh man, my hands are a little sweaty. Oh, it's too hot in here. Okay. Okay. Here we go. I don't know what a champion belt even does, okay, really. Let's have some fun. Who'd have thought it'd be oh. this close? You're better than I thought. <laughs> okay. Well, we both fell at least. Poetry in motion. Oh man, who's gonna win this one? Oh. It's too close to tell. I believe in you. You are in the zone. How much training do you do? Oh my god, it's really long. It's an extra long challenge. Poetry in motion. How is he doing them so much faster than me? Slow and steady. One poetry in motion. I believe in you. You are in the you can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! How much training you Oh my gosh, I'm gonna build up a sweat! I can't get enough of those beautiful muscles! Poetry and mo- better than my How much training you can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! Oh my gosh! I believe in you! You are in the- How much training I can hear your muscles crying out in the you! How much training Poetry and- Slow and steady! One, two, two, Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. Nothing to it. Oh wow, that was intense. But I did it. First try, Brie. Wow, I am shaking. I am sweating. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe that. That was so hard. Oh my gosh, I have like this adrenaline rush through my whole body. Wow. Oh. 
Oh, wow. That was fun. Man, I think it's like the not breathing while you're trying to keep the pace. That is, that was, oh, I need to hydrate. Wow. -y. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I messed him up. Champion belt for me. I'm a pro squatter. <laughs> I have no idea how strong you really Thanks, were. Thanks, Jules. You truly are something, aren't you? I sure am. Listen up, everyone. We can be stronger, <sighs> better. Let's hit those weights. I beat Jules. You got it, Jules. What else do you have to Let's say, you sir? Let's and me work up a sweat. No, no, no. I don't want to challenge you again. No, it's too hard. No. No. <laughs> need a break. I need a break from the competitive stuff. Wow. Okay. Oh yeah, this nasty, nasty gym bathroom. I forgot about that. Gross. Okay, um... So it doesn't actually look like there's anything to do in this gym right now. So I don't know if, um... Oh, what if I go over here? Oh, okay. So it looks like that's not an option yet, which means we'll have to come back. Ooh, that really got my blood pumping and it's hot in here. It rained today in California, but I'm still like, oh my gosh, I'm stuck in this gym. I'll never get out. Oh yeah, let's see what we got as a reward. Let's see. Uh, I'm guessing it's wearable. Champion belt, what does this do? A belt made for the reigning workout champion. Brianna White, also known as Aerith but we have to see what it does. Uh... Where are you? Champion belt. Increases max HP by 10% and strength by five. That's huge. Wait a minute. That's amazing. That's exactly what I want from Cloud. That's exactly my Cloud build. That's awesome. That's really exciting. I'm happy. Okay, cool. Oh, did it? Tears do make the man. It's true. Where men become men. See, that's the problem. Where's where's the lady gym? Must needs. Okay. Um, the party never stops is what we are headed to next. And what are we going to get? What shenanigans are we going to enter into here? Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? I like the... Oh, you must be that's the, the clothing store owner's about. son. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. Oh my gosh. I mean it, I'm still shaking right now. That was intense. <sighs> okay, so we gotta go pick up. We gotta go pick up. Wait up, Cloud. Sam caught me up on everything. He said you are gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Walmart. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand. Bro. So I can answer all of your questions. Now, Bro, let, let me help you out. This one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Directors, How do you know what quest I'm on, up. Johnny? Also, you're just all too willing to go to a bar quest, aren't you, sir? Uh, Wait a minute. How come also... Walk through the door? Like I'm getting a regular's only clothes. kind of vibe. Get them while they're hot. Why does Johnny look so much like Reno? He's even got the like red symbols on him and like Reno has the like symbols over here. I feel like Johnny and Reno could be brothers. Anybody else get that vibe? This is the drunkard's den, the best place in Wall Market to drink away your problems. Would you know that, Johnny, from personal experience? This 
This is the Drunkard's Den, the best place in Wall okay. Market to drink away your problems. Thanks, Johnny. It's mostly the same folks every night, so... Whoa, you can't just waltz in there on uninvited. Why not? Listen, Look at me. I just waltzed right in here. Hey, wait for me! Come on in, Johnny. Move it or lose it. <clears throat> oh! We already saw this guy last time we were in here! Wasn't he- didn't he say something like, leave me alone? Oh look, darts, the other minigame I just owned at. Wow, this is always what happens. I do one good thing in a game and then my head inflates so that it doesn't even fit in this room. And then I immediately get super wrecked right after. This always happens to me. Mark my words, I'm about to get wrecked. Oh yeah, with the beef intestines. Oh, and this guy. What's going on in here? Anything exciting? Oh! So many people here with upset stomachs. Is the food here not good? It's probably because they're selling intestines. I'm gonna need to know exactly the lyrics to Under the Rotting Pizza. All right, Daddy-O, you got a clothing store to run. Hey, old dude. Huh? Son, is that you? Did you always look so moronic? Oh. Well, right back at you. Poor Johnny. Whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back. Not ever. My life is ruined. It's over. Kill me now. Come on. There's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son. See, I made this bet with the materia merchant. A sure thing, but then I lost. And what did you lose? So I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration. Your precious inspir- who with the what now? Inspiration. <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it, but I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. Leave Poor it to Johnny. Me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? <sighs> Johnny has totally come in here and and stolen our quest from us. Like, we are the Merc, we were given this quest, we're supposed to have a night out on the town, and Johnny's come in here and been like, I got you, old man! I will solve your problem. Midgar. Um, want an autograph? Do you know who I am? My new favorite thing to say. <laughs> uh, okay. Where'd you go? The party never stops. To the materia shop! So we go around this corner. And then we go up here. Yonder this direction. Back to close to Madam M's. I'm starting to get my bearings in this place. All right, Johnny, what do we have here? This place looks kind of creepy, don't you think? Like maybe they practice. Yes, it is creepy. Or... It is creepy. Hey, wait for me! Come on in, Johnny. Back me up. So this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. Well, that's true. But I tell you what. I'll consider giving it back in exchange for a favor. Uh, what you need? Something only 
real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the end. You know what? You know. No, I don't think I... Wait, the sauce. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. What have I gotten myself into here? I don't know if your powers of assessment are all that to brag about, Johnny. I'm gonna see some weird shit tonight, yeah! Oh, Johnny. Listen, I don't know what the sauce is, but I have concerns if it's something only real men can deliver. And... I have the perfect room for the both of you. Just say the word and I'll show you do it. Huh? No, 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 we're not here for that. Say what? If you don't need a room, then what the hell do you want? Oh, do you all remember? Do you remember when I first came into this area and something was going on with Johnny and I was with Aerith and the Barker said something and I didn't quite understand what he was saying and then I asked him how much and then Aerith got mad at me? <laughs> so I went back and watched the VOD and basically the Barker insinuates that they're a couple looking for a room for the night and then I literally asked how much I didn't hear what he said <laughs> poor Aerith poor Aerith is probably so upset with my depravity um but this time I paid extra attention to what this guy was saying um, and he basically insinuated the same thing about me and Johnny so I mean he, he's just a barker doing his job uh, okay. Let's see what he says if I talk to him again. No preferences we can't accommodate. No, sir. Right, and he says that pretty much to Aerith as well. Okay, uh, into the inn. And we gotta get the sauce. Now, I know there's a term for, I think it's, it's called hitting the sauce, which is when you get super drunk, I think. Am I, am I imagining that? So, there's something to do with that, but I have a feeling there's something else going on here. Also, just hold on a moment and just take a look at the picture on this vending machine. It's, what, a baby on a cloud? But it's blue. And what is it holding? Is it like a cloud comet? That's it. That's the one. It looks like a regular old vending machine, right? But wait. <laughs> you ready for this? I don't think I am. All right. This particular model has secret buttons. Oh, well Where? then. Well, I can't tell you, it's a secret. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expertise, like grab it and whip it out. And then you'll be able to see everything. Don't whip it out! Use assess to find the secret buttons. The higher the materia usage, the luckier, luckier? Luckier? I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. <laughs> you tell him, Cloud. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. Come on, bro. You know there are more hidden buttons waiting to be pushed. Okay. Oh. This is the sauce. Neato. It, it's time. The last button. It, it's time. What is happening? The sauce. <laughs> Put it away. Put it away before someone 
sees you, no one can know that we have it. What? You're the grand prize. Ah, it's yelling at me. A special prize. Ah, 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 don't scare me like that. Whatever. We got what we came here for. Let's get out of here and head to the materia guy. What am I involved in? <laughs> What do you have to say about this saucery, sir? Welcome. Are you in need of accommodations? No. Okay. So we have interesting. Okay, so there are key items. We have What? An item shrouded in mystery and dispensed from a vending machine. What is this? Crimson Spike, an energy drink from the vending machine at the inn. That looks kind of cool. Vitalibrew, a special potion from the vending machine in the inn. Okay, that looks cool too. This is Chocobo Sam's request book. He is a disorganized fellow. Okay, so we got the sauce and now everybody's staring at us. So where are the shady areas? That's easy. The old now where did Johnny go? Back to the Materia guy. Okay. Okay. Let's head on over. Come on, bro. Hurry up. Don't rush me. All right. You ready for this? I've already said no. I'm clearly not. There's some something weird going on here. <laughs> Let's show him what we brought back from our little trip into the weed. Oh, it's you two. It's time, bro. The sauce. Could it be? Oh, it is. I lost all the of them? Sauce. The sauce. Whoa. Oh, never thought I'd live to see the day. It's just sauce. <laughs> do do? Don't sell yourself short. This is only given to one who is truly a man among men. <laughs> I know. How does he know? That's why you're such an awesome dude. All right. Hate to break it to you, but that thing you were looking for, not here. It's long, long gone. Beat him up. You shitting me? Nope. Sorry. As I recall, the guy who runs the restaurant should have it. Ugh. No, well, no. This is where we take next. the sauce Come back. On, bro. Because the deal's been broken. Well, that's that. Time to polish the old orbs. Give them a spit shine so they positively sparkle. Hey, if you're done here, then get going already. Restaurant up next, huh? The innuendo in this game is inappropriate. Nope. Stay focused. We have work to do first. I was not prepared. My goodness, sir. Just gonna admit it like that. I didn't ask you. So we gotta go to the restaurant now to try and get this inspiration. And we totally got ripped off by the Materia guy. Man, I like seriously don't know which one to get. I'm a decisive guy, but when it comes to food, it's a different story. I feel you on that one. I also love hey, wait food. For me. I, still don't know what I, want to order yet. I am always at every restaurant the last person to order. I always take such a long time to decide what I want. I'm very indecisive. <clears throat> Welcome. Okay, sir. Feel free to take any open seats. I'm here for Sorry, the inspiration. Here the materia guy gave you something, yeah? We want it. 
Materia guy? Oh, you hear about that? I'm surprised. Didn't take you for the type. Let me ask you something. Either of you know anything about cooking? Nope, never cooked once. That's too bad. For some reason, my food doesn't taste nearly as good as it used to. I was hoping one of you two might be able to help me figure it out. I've narrowed it down to the fridge, the stove, or the power supply. But I'm not sure what's to blame. What is this? What is, what is this? Why didn't they tell me I should be leveling up my materia? What is this reward for people who are grinding in the game who don't need to? Why? The higher level your magic materia, the better advice you'll give. But why? Man, I seriously have no <clears> idea <throat> what it could be. This sucks. The problem is, give advice based on your strongest magic materia, but all of mine are level two. I guess we'll do fire, I don't know. Also, it doesn't say which one is associated with which materia. What if my fire materia was level one? How would I know which one was associated with which? Is it just the same order? Oh, this is annoying. I've got it. The problem is the heat's not. No, Johnny, that's terrible advice. Know a little something about fire, do you? Okay. Then. Never tell them the heat's not high enough. You gotta right. cook things low and slow, Johnny. Low and slow. Oh, we're gonna burn his restaurant down. Well, will you look at that? Works fine. Here. Eat up. Oh, okay. Man, it worked this out. looks great. Oh, that does look good. Oh, I'm hungry now. I haven't eaten dinner yet. I can't. Everybody in what this town is vomiting. He seemed to be enjoying the meal, so I wanted to ask him what he thought. Maybe next time. Anyway, thanks for your help. Oh. And here's a voucher with my apologies. Get the poor guy some medicine, will you? Drugs. I need all the drugs. Oh right my now. gosh. What nonsense yeah, is right. this is so no. goofy. Oh. Get your delicious materia pops right here. Yes, right here. Where'd you go, sir? Come back here. You went to the shop. Wait, we didn't even ask the restaurateur about the about the Goodbye. Are you saying goodbye, cruel world, like you're about to die? It's a little dramatic, Johnny. Hey, you. This yours? Yes. Well. He's my doofus. Oh, that about you you got there? Should have said something sooner. Come on in. He's really dramatic, that Johnny. What is it with today? People are dropping like flies. Besides this dumbass? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, loads of I got enough outstanding orders to fill a book. I was See, everybody's sick in this town. Enough. There's something to do with this. Uh, I uh, can't very well leave him alone now, can I? No, I gave you my hey, voucher you're already. Not doing much. Maybe you can deliver that medicine for me. But you're where's the what? inspiration? Or something, right? Then you must know a thing or two about dealing with the sick and injured. There's more materia quests. What is this? <sighs> I'm gonna be no help at all. You're a lifesaver, literally. So, let me see, what needs delivery? Here, need you to deliver this to someone. You'll probably find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere, but make sure you check his symptoms before giving him meds. Check his symptoms before giving him meds. I feel like, I feel like this quest is is like designed for me to fail. I haven't had enough combat experiences with more than two people that I have even had the ability to level up materials very much. I mean, I've had fire on Cloud the entire time he's been fighting and it's still only level two. So I don't know anybody who can do this quest Unless maybe you're in hard mode and 
you already have your leveled up materia and you can redo the quests? Is that what this is about? Like you're supposed to fail it here? Would have loved you with Tifa just once. Johnny, I didn't ask you what you wanted to do with Tifa. This game. All right, where am I going here? Uh, where am I going? Uh oh. That's odd. Do I have to? Oh. What? Okay, so I was given what? One bottle of anti-emetic, which I believe is anti-nausea, anti-vomit. So there's like, we'll say eight people in alleys vomiting. There are at least two that I can think of. Am I supposed to pick which one based on which one I need to get a reward from so I can get behind to get the treasure chest? But that means I have to know which one, it, I mean, I have to go back through every single alley. That's gonna drive me insane. That's gonna take way too long. In sector five. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there the guy's sick, but he's not blocking off a treasure chest. I wish I could put markers on this map. Okay. So not that one. Is there one over here? No. Not that one, maybe one of these? But I just want all, <clears throat> excuse me, I get emotional when I think about it. I want all the takes, not just some of them. I don't want to have to pick. I just want all the treasure. These guys aren't sick. But they are guarding a treasure. <clears throat> what about... No. We did that one, we did this one. <clears throat> okay, let's go check out the ones down here. I feel like this is gonna take way too much time and even if I was playing this not on stream, I would very much just check a guide. These guys are the mobsters. I dare. You are wrong, sir. Folia may be new, but she is clearly the best. Because I don't I just don't want to waste all my time wandering around looking for the right guy to give medicine to just to unlock a chest. This is Folia back here. And Gotta stay sharp there's another alley right around here. Excuse me, sir. And that's not even an alley. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take four ever. What about up here? This way. This guy is sick. Do we have a sick guy back here? This is a sick guy back here, but he's not blocking a treasure chest. So let's drop this off to, um, to the guy in the bar bathroom. In the bar bathroom. The bar bathroom. The bar is where? It's right 
right by the squats gym, right? So I'm pretty sure it's right. No, that's the clothing shop, which would make this the bar, right? That sounds right. Okay, so I gotta come out of this alleyway, but I need to be on the ground floor. It is so easy to get lost in this place. I am so confused and very lost in this place. Oh, wait a minute. Clothing shop. Gym. Nope, I'm lost again. Ah, oh, the bar! Nailed it. Okay, into this nasty, grimy bathroom. And... Wait a minute! He's got a dang quest marker! Now why, if he has a quest marker, is it not on the map? <gasps> what is this nonsense? Oh boy, classic. <laughs> it was poison, I tell ya. The sick son of a bitch puts poison in his food. I've got meds. Let me take a look at you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you saved my life. You're welcome. Yeah. It's not much, but it's yours. I'm so no. helpful. I'm grateful for your help, but do you think a guy could get a little privacy? I just burst in on him in the bathroom, and he's like, can you leave? Please go. You should probably head back. Okay. Now what? Have just one. The more Johnny's probably have still get. sick in the so pharmacy. Yeah, okay. So let's just head there. And see what's next. Oh, Johnny's been cured. And Great. then there was this crazy looking house, right? And it was all like trying to kill him. But then Cloud was all like, bam, bam, boom. Your friend fought a house. Yeah, I did. A house? Oh, and hey. I killed it. Welcome back, bro. Better already? Yeah, now he won't shut up. Anyway, That's Johnny. How the delivery's gone. I did about as much as I could. Thanks for the help. Great work. Anyway, I promise to be worth your while. Here, I got something you're definitely gonna like. What is it? Well, it belonged to the owner of the clothing. Yes, that's what I'm here for. That's From what this whole thing has been about. Been running all over town looking for this. Am I right? Wait, we have? Hold up. Oh, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. Oh, shit! The inspiration! Bingo. You see, all us Walmart and entrepreneurs go way back. We get together for a game every night, bet all kinds of stuff. This found its way into the pool and eventually into my possession, and now it's yours, because, hey, why the hell not? It's a VIP card, highly coveted and extremely rare. They're only given to a select few. Not having it is gonna do you much good, but... Holy mother of... No way! Bro, we gotta get to the honey... I, 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 I mean, drunkards on the double! Tell the old man I said hi! Wait a minute! A VIP ticket? Could that be to the Honey Bee Inn? So that we can get around having... But he said, not that it's gonna do you much good to have it anyway. So I'm guessing there's something else in the works. That you can't just have a VIP card and get into the Honey Bee Inn. There's something else going on because of course there is! Okay. Back to the shop. It will be really nice to see this to a nice conclusion. Come on, come on, come on! I gotta know! My heart is beating so fast, bro. Hey, old like dude, we're bro. back! Huh? Who are you? You're no son of mine. I think. Special delivery, just for you. 
<laughs> My inspiration! You've returned to me at long last! Yo, is that what I think it is? Oh, you bet it is! And it was hard won! I sew dresses day and night for those ladies until I got what I was after! A honeybee in VIP! I bar. knew it! I knew it! <laughs> now make way for the VIP, boys! I don't want to keep my ladies waiting any longer! Love it when that happens! But first, I should pick up a gift dress! Lead the way, old dude! We are coming! Oh, we're coming with you? Is that what Johnny thinks is about to happen? Okay. So, what an exciting time it is to be alive and to be in this game. That right there, my friends, is where we're going to end today's episode. Oh, we're in such a good part in the game. Do you love it as much as I do? I cannot believe we are where we are and that this is all happening. I'm, it just blows my mind. Thank you all so much for watching. Please leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite Aerith line of dialogue has been so far. Because I'm just curious. I hear a lot of people commenting one thing and then a lot of people will comment another thing. And honestly, all of her lines are great, but I need to know the best one. So let's just have a civil discussion in the comments. And uh, I'm excited to chat with you guys there. Please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. And that is all. I love you all very much.